Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice math problem? We have 4 raised to power 98 plus 16 raised to power 50 divided by 4 raised to power 99 plus 256 raised to power 25. From here, let's change everything to have this 4. And uh, we can write this as 4 raised to power 98 plus, yes, yeah, 16, same thing as 4 square. That's 4 times 4, then raised to power 50. Then divided by, here we have 4 raised to power 99. Then plus 256, and we're written as 4 raised to power 4. That's 4 multiplied itself, 4 times, and that's raised to power 25 from here. Then from the law of indices, that is this power here, we multiply and uh, here we have 4 raised to power 98 then plus 4 raised to power 50 times 2 that's 100 then divided by 4 raised to power 99 then plus here 4 raised to power 100 that's 25 times 4 then next we can separate this 100 as 98 plus 2 so we have 4 is to power 98 plus 4 is to power 98 plus 2 here yeah, divided by here yeah, we can write this as 4 is to power 99 then plus also we can separate this as 99 plus 1 so we have 4 is to power 99 plus 1 then when we apply the law of indices from here, we can separate it and we have 4 raised to power 98 plus 4 raised to power 98 times 4 raised to power 2. That is the same thing with this. Then divided by, here we have 4 raised to power 99 plus 4 raised to power 99 times 4 raised to power 1 then now we can factor what is common here we have 4 raised to power 98 common so we can say this is 4 raised to power 98 into bracket 1 left here now then plus 4 square left here then divided by here 4 raised to power 99 is common so we have 4 raised to power 99 into bracket 1 plus 4 raised to power 1 then from here, we have this 4 raised to power 98. We cancel this power of 99, only remain, you know, 4 here because 99 minus 98, that's 1, that's 4 raised to power 1, which is 4. Then up there, we have 1 plus 4 squared, that's 4 times 4, which is 16. Then divided by here, we have 4 times, you know, 4 is to power 1, that's still 4, that's now 1 plus 4 there. Then, which we can say this is 17 up, then divided by 4 times 5 here. So, which we can write as 17 over 20. So, here the simplified form of this problem given is now 17 over 20. And here we have come to the end of this class. Thank you for watching. Don't forget the steps. Subscribe for more exciting videos. Turn the notification bell on. See you next class. Then, bye for now.